What's happening today? Who's coming here? Mama. Yeah, where are they going to come? Really? Really? Where are we going to get them from? I'm going to see my dad every day for just over two weeks, which hasn't happened since I was 10. And a very good morning to you guys. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to a new vlog. Welcome to an incredibly hot day yeah. here in Manila in the Philippines. I think this is our hottest day so far. I think you're right. I don't think it's quite that summer switch yet where you go, oh goodness me, it's actually really, really hot now and you just drip with sweat when you step outside. No. But it's definitely hotter than it has been. Can you hold that? It place? really, of course, of course. We have um, had our breakfast at the hotel. We've got some coffee to go. Although I'm already sussing out what coffee shop I'm going to go to today. I think I know because we are currently walking. Oh, we're in the shade. That's quite nice. We've currently walked right up BGC um, to the top end. Market Market is kind of behind me this way, but we are heading to one of our favorite shopping malls this morning to make some final preparations and pick up a few final bits for our upcoming island adventure. <laughs> Koda in a very good mood this morning as usual. He actually didn't have the best night's sleep. I know we talk about like a little bit of parenting, a little bit of behind the scenes on the vlogs. Um, last night he woke up in the middle of the night for around two hours so we were all up from about 1 a.m. to about 3 a.m. 3.30 a.m. something like that so that was tricky but we're trying to wake ourselves up this morning another coffee is definitely due but yes SM Aura right ahead of us haven't been here yet on this trip one of our favorite shopping malls get a few more bits before the island adventures begin because this evening what's happening today who's coming here Mama. yeah where are they gonna come Really? Where are we going to get them from? The airport. Really? And what are they going on? Lemonade. Yeah! Is it today? Yeah. It's today! So yes, that is right. Coda has made the official announcement. They are in the air right now. Jason and Claire are arriving today in, in this vlog. They're getting to Hong Kong in about three hours. They've got an hour and a half layover and then another hour and a, uh, maybe two hour flight to Manila. So yes. about 6.30 p.m. today for us. We're going to be at Naya Terminal 3. Naia. Na, na, ia. Someone, um, people were commenting how to properly pronounce it. Naia. We say like Naya, we like blend it, but it's like Naia. Naia? Naia. Yes, Koda, that's right. Koda's oh, got it right. my bad. That's yeah. been a long so time. So for years we've said that wrong, so apologies. Naia. However, yes, Driver George. Gonna get the van. Thank you for all the recommendations on the parking as well. They're landing at Terminal 3, so I think I know where to park. Then we can meet them at the arrivals. Very, very, very exciting day. I feel like we've been saying it for a long time. This trip has been booked with them for a very long time. I know, they really can't wait. Your monkey. <laughs> I was just thinking, something feels different in this mall. Something feels a little bit... I know what you're gonna say. And uh, it's because last time we were here, was all Christmas. the Christmas lights yeah, were here. Crazy, it was way more sparkly. Island vibes. What, some swimming shorts? Green, he wants you to wear these, I think. Green are a bit bright for me. I don't want to stand out too much. Maybe blue. They're so cheap, 399 yeah, I pesos. I could get one of each color. The gray's quite nice. I kind of like the gray, that yeah. would look good when you got a tan. Yeah, they're okay, aren't they? And it looks like a Tommy Hilfiger ripoff. It does indeed. They'll do. They're not your little short shorts. Well, they're quite short. That's not mid length. That's quite short, isn't it? Well, they're because I'm tall, you see. Okay, we just came into Toby's estate. They've got these new cups, which I really like. Look, a little colourful cup. Really nice. Coda's having a little pit stop, having his sandwich and an orange. And we just met some people behind us who have travelled in from the States and they're in the Philippines for a wedding and they watch the channel. They were like, they recognized Coda first. They saw Coda and um, they were like, oh, it's you guys. So always, 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 always nice to meet people who watch the channel. So if you see us, always say hi because we see so many comments, we have messages saying, I saw you guys last night, I was too shy to approach you to say hi, but we're always up for a picture or to just chat or say hi. So don't be shy. Oh, really? Yeah. What's that? The, the giraffe. The giraffe. giraffe. And can you say it in America? Can you Coda. say it in American? <laughs> Coda now says stuff in an American accent. Can you say dinosaur? In, can you say it in American? My dad dots. Can you say dinosaur in American? My dad dots. Can you yeah. say triceratops in American? 
Oh, hold on. Can you say can you say sticker in American? Sticker. Yeah, it's so How good funny. a two-year-old do an American How does he accent? get accents? Yeah, I don't know. I know. So nice talking to those guys over there um, in Toby's and about our experience in the Philippines and we were chatting about like bullet and stuff and it reminded me George still hasn't tried it. So if everyone can leave a comment right now. And also, should we get my dad and stepmom to try Balut? That would be really good, actually. They were like, have you tried it? It's almost like an initiation into the Philippines. If you've tried Balut, you're legit. If you haven't, you're not. Which means, George, we need to get on him. We need to get on him about that. Um, but yeah, feeling kind of emotional about it tonight, actually. Are you sure? Yeah. Really? I'm really excited It's so it. big. Yeah. How big is that? Well, this is the best shop ever. We'll come in here all day. Yeah, I'm feeling kind of crazy about tonight, actually, because not to get too deep in this vlog, but I haven't spent this much time with my dad since I was 10 years old. So when my parents split up, I lived with my mum, and obviously I saw my dad, like, often, but I never spent, like, weeks with him at a time, and he's here for just over two weeks, which means I'm going to see my dad every day for just over two weeks, which hasn't happened since I was 10. So it's, like, quite emotional for me, and the fact that they're just going to suddenly be here, and we're going to have this, like, quality time together, and also them experience, like, a place that means so much to us. It's just, like, a whirlwind, and I've got, like, a lump in my throat talking about it. I don't know what it is, but it's a crazy feeling, and I'm, like, getting all deep, and there's, like, Barbie behind me, and I'm in a kid's oh. shop with dinosaurs all over me but yeah it's really cool and I can't wait so the countdown's on I'm feeling very tired after last night I've got a bit of a headache so hopefully I can shake it off a bit before they get here but um <laughs> we'll, have to put, we'll put some back first this one's quite creepy this pterodactyl isn't it it's a bit like realistic the face on that yeah I don't like that that's that's George before his morning coffee yeah. It's time to go to the airport. And who are we going to get? Nanny. Who are we going to get? Nanny. Not Nanny, we're going to get Grandpa and... Grandma. And what are you going to say to them? Go to the Philippines. Welcome to the Philippines. We are super excited, aren't we? Yeah. Are we excited? And what are we going to get for dinner? Uh, spaghetti. Spaghetti. From? Cheese on it. Yeah, with cheese on it. Yeah, but where are we going to get the spaghetti from? Do you remember we see the big bee? What is it? Bee. Jolly bee. Jolly bee. Jolly bee? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna get Jolly bee as well. Right, should we go get the van? Yeah. Let's go. The van key. The van key. Yeah. Where's the van key? That daddy got it. Daddy's got it. Yeah. I actually don't, so probably uh, would be a good start to find the van key. You've got to hold this coder. You have to hold the sign. He's so excited. He is, isn't he? Look yeah. at him. He's really excited. Mind your fingers, baby. Hold this sign for mummy. And say welcome to this airport transfer journey with your driver George. We have an estimated arrival of 6:30 p.m. Please sit back, enjoy the ride. Refreshments will be served at intervals throughout the journey. Please have your credit card ready. We also accept GCash. Guys, we're at the airport. It's getting very real. They just text to say they've landed. We saw that they'd landed on online. Hi guys. Hi guys. So they just text to say that. Welcome to the Philippines, yeah. They've just texted to say that they're waiting in the line for immigration and then they're just going to collect their luggage. Um, and then that's it, we're ready. So actually we've timed this, timed this really well. We're hopefully a couple of minutes away from the car park and then we won't have to wait for too long for them. We're hopefully going to be there when they come out because that was a plan. But traffic has been awful because um, it's rush hour. So hopefully we meet, we meet them. I don't want to miss them coming through. They've done like a 24 hour journey and we miss them at the last bit. But um, if they have to wait for two minutes, that's okay. It's tense. Let's hope I'm going to get a good tip as the driver on this journey. Do I go over there, yeah? I don't know, George. Parking, it's just parking. Someone sent you a photo and I remember that sign. Yeah. Look, that's the sign, isn't it? Someone sent you a photo on Instagram, right? I think someone did, yeah, that but that was just that. Yeah, so I just need to keep left for parking. Arrival, you go back over that way. So yeah, parking here. But there's two, I can't read it. It's parking, parking. Yeah. Not parking, parking, is it? You don't park the park. But do you walk the walk? You may park the park. But what does that say under the parking parking? I mean, they say a lot of things twice in the Philippines. Market, market, lapu, lapu, parking, parking. Thank you, hello. Literally, the airport entrance is over there. We can find a space and run over, we're gonna make it. If they, oh my God, it's so busy. If there's nowhere to park. Well, everyone's parked on the side like that. Everyone's like blocking everyone in. But why, they wouldn't let people in if there wasn't a space, right? 
well, they might. Would they? Okay, we found a parking space. The original plan was to go in the indoor multi-story, but we're in the outdoor parking. Doesn't really matter because we can just run over the road now. We're pretty much exactly where they're going to come out. We just hope. Oh yeah, near Mega World. Okay, cool. So yes, we did it. We officially picked. Well, we haven't picked them up yet, but we officially drove to the airport and parked in Manila. I'm going to jot that down as an achievement. Never done that before. Right, can you hold this back quickly? Let's go, Coda. We've got to find Grandpa. How do we get out over there, though? Yeah, we're at the airport. He knows. You're going to hold, hold your sign. sign. You hold, hold it, it that way. Mummy, hold it. All right, I'll hold it. Okay. Big moment. Huge moment. Crazy. Thank you. It's the airport. You hold your sign, mate. Can you see them? Nice oh, there they are. Look, look. Wow. <laughs> oh, yeah. There they are. Yeah. Look. Can you see them? The sign. The sign. Who is it? Who is it? <laughs> Hello, how are you doing? You okay? Welcome, welcome to the Philippines. Oh, he's leaning behind. There you go. <laughs> you made it, suitcase. Yes. How are you doing? Very well, okay? Yes, thank good, you very good. much. You both look very fresh, considering. You do, actually. I mean, it's a bit exhausted anyway, isn't it? But the flight was pretty good. The long leg to Hong Kong, I slept two or three times, maybe even four times, just on and off. But you know, very nice. Blanket up very here. Good. I feel like we've just eaten. Yeah. 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 Good, good. Do you have that stomach after a yeah. where you're just like and just weird got, and sleepy. Just got fed again as well on this uh, camera. It's <laughs> <laughs> an hour and a half, and they give you like a three course one. Uh, it was a proper. <laughs> On top of the three good, years. good, good. We had lounge passes at Heathrow's, we had three courses there, three Perfect. beers. We got on the plane, glass of fizz. Yeah. Then, uh, Hold the are you suitcase. Gonna move, you're going to pull my suitcase. Hang on a second. You're going to help. Yeah, yeah. We are. Yeah. So we left for plenty of time and then obviously, we were late. Manila, the famous Manila like traffic. 50 minutes ago, you said you were on your yeah. way last time. Oh my god. Yeah. It's dreadful. <laughs> Rush hour, well, you, that's You'll that. see it all over. You're here. I'm literally shaking. You're, in, the, you're in Manila. Look at my hands. Crazy. <laughs> the adventure begins. It really does. So it does yes. Right, let's get you SIM cards. Oh, yes. So yes, this way SIM first. Cards. All right. It's funny, we just did this routine like a week ago when we were here. We got the cash out, we got the SIM cards, um, and now we're doing it again with them. But we're nearly sorted. Then we're going to walk to the uh, parking. But I can't believe how quiet it is. Look around. The time is. Wow. They only landed. Well, they landed just an hour ago, and we're about to leave, which is really fast to get through immigration and. Um, baggage but we're very nearly done with the sims Coda and George are running around we wanted to get him some Jollibee spaghetti but the queue's really long so I don't think we're gonna we might get him something else to eat quickly but we are heading back to BGC in a second which is exciting what's happening here keeping Coda entertained touch the green sign okay Whoa. and Whoa. my workout for tonight nice Whoa. no time to gym today no exactly nice handbag thank you very much <laughs> my color I think yeah it is How and my grandpa they're over there yeah can you get it can you get it can you get it, can you get it? show mommy it's so weird that they're here. Like I can't. Like this is my dad. My dad stood behind me in Manila. It's That's so mad. surreal. That's so, it's so, it's so weird. Also, it's so normal now that it's here. I should probably go back and just see if they need any help. But um, it's so smooth. Hey, how are you? <laughs> yeah, of course. Let's go. We can go out that way. Are you ready to feel the heat? Yes. Experience the heat of the Philippines. Has been like waiting for this moment. Three layers. Three layers. A vest, a jumper, and a denim jacket. Good luck, Good luck to you. <laughs> She won't be hot. Be <laughs> it's a bit chilly. Nice. It's a bit of a breeze, actually. Warmed up. Yeah. There's <laughs> a van, Koda. There's a van. There's a van. Hey, there's heat. There's heat. A little it's bit. It's just effectively bad there. <laughs> I know, hey. you think you're through it, and then it's like, oh, there it is. Yeah. <laughs> right, so we are parked. Yeah. We can go straight, we can go over, straight over. Yeah? And just walk through the car park. Quite cold after being in there. Oh really? And I'm like sort of the defrosting now, and it's nice. Oh, I see. Because we'll we'll the air Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, that was so kind. They're experiencing some Filipino kindness already. A viewer of the channel who we met coming into the airport just ran up to us again and said, "Hey, um, I bought some snacks for your parents to try." 
So she's like gone ahead and bought this and knew we'd like be in traffic both sides. Said you'll probably be hungry, have some snacks. And like found us again somehow and got these. So if you're watching the vlog, which I think you are, because you were very up to date with the whole story and what's going on. Huge thank you to you, it's very, very kind. Oh, bless them. Oh, I didn't realise that. I just said thank you. I yeah. think we were just saying for Canada. Yeah. Oh, then. They're Crispy local. things. Nice, nice. <laughs> What's that? No, Dried on. mango. Oh. That's very no, no, that's tasty. Mango that's tamarind with mango. Oh, okay. Nice, nice. Okay. What else? Don't tell Claire about snacks. Dried <laughs> mango balls. Oh, very, very nice. Can't go wrong. Can't go wrong. What do you fancy, Claire? <laughs> What's the choices? So. Have we got any Prosecco? Uh, no. <laughs> Dried mango balls. Uh, mango, mango with mango and tamarind. <laughs> and a buono cordic, not hot garlic flavour. <laughs> that was stinky banana. Okay, that bone. <laughs> stinky garlic ones it is. <laughs> like a bit of garlic. Public transport. Yeah, jeepneys. I don't know if we'll take a jeepney at any point, maybe. They look packed. Yeah. Yes. Are they cheap? Very they're cheap. Yeah. They're like the locals commute on them basically. There, you see the little like the curved roof. I don't know if you can see. There's three in a row there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We're yeah. the far left of things. Far right. We're like top. Yeah, McKinley Hill. That's our sort of area. Yeah. So that's our old stomping ground. Yeah, yeah. So you nice. see that sign with the circle on the right? That says BGC. Yeah. So that's yeah. now we're now in BGC. Okay. This is the border. This is the border. We're crossing the border into BGC. Nice. It gets like a little bit. And there's B. There's BGC. Border guards control. <laughs> okay. <laughs> And he's got a hat. Yeah. It'll be a bit warm for wearing. Yeah. Everything. Trying to see their boots as well. They have got big, like big boots, Superman. yeah. Superman boots. They are, though, aren't they? Yeah. A line there in front of you as well. Yeah, probably yeah. more easy to see during the day, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, oh, definitely, yeah. All the way up there. Oh, okay. And then all the way down there, basically. Mountains. <laughs> yeah. Jason. Shake Shack. Shake Shack. Shake yeah. Shack. Is shake shack. I love Shake Shack. We had that last night, actually. Yeah. <laughs> Did you? I yeah, shut the okay. smell burgers with your window. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Suddenly, I could probably manage just a small one. Yeah, <laughs> we could share one. Do they do a happy meal in uh, Shake Shack? Basically, the hotel's right at the top of the high street that way, okay. so we we'll just go right. So it's really, really good. Location. We're not going to have to do shopping though, are we? Uh, up to you. That's the. I don't know if you saw the vlog where we went into that. You know. Uh, yeah, drop off and then parking. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Right, I've got my next uh, visitors arriving, landing in an hour. Your next fucking so, uh, next yeah. fair. <laughs> exactly. Oh, 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 the water there and the lights on the left and the right, so that's like oh, parallel yeah. to the high street. Yes, we now. drove this way, didn't we? Yeah, 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 exactly. Well, we drove along there, there and we looked left and down. We'll go to the right and then we'll go to the right. That's a nice view, isn't it? That's amazing. So, where's yours? You on the other side. Maybe that side, I don't know. And that's where the planes come in, I think. This, this is the oh, flight really part, isn't it? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> shower cap. Got to wash my Yeah, we'll be needing that. Shower cap. Oh, definitely, oh, definitely. Partial to slippers. Mm. Does he have yeah. robes? Yes, I know. Robes. Very oh, nice. Oh, we've got a little fridge. Yeah, good, good. The good. desk as well, so I have to do some work. There you go. My laptop, my little fridge. Wow, big job. Perfect. Cool, good. The bed's really yeah. comfy, actually. <laughs> <laughs> 24 oh, hours later, yeah. <laughs> made it. So it's 9 p.m. now, oops, that's zooming in. Um, and is it 9 p.m. I think? 9, 9 something, 9, 10. And um, George is getting coded to bed upstairs, but we wanted to just see the high street a little bit tonight. And then we're gonna head up to the rooftop for a drink. Um, George and I forgot to eat dinner, we were quite excited and we've realized how hungry we are now. Um, so we want to make sure we've had something to eat before going to bed. So we are going to have a little look at the high street, get some, pick up some food, take it back to George, and then head up to the rooftop. But we're about to see BBC High Street for the first time, which is very exciting. One of my favourite places. <laughs> so it's a Thursday night, so it's not crazy busy. <laughs> London Underground. But, um, yeah, there you go. You feel at home already. London Underground. Um, and then the high, basically the high street split into sections, so this is one little bit of it and then the roads uh, separate it all out. So um, they're all a little bit different but they're all like food, drinks, 
shops. Um, Still lots of people out about. Yeah, it's, it's always like this here. And I think it's more so than last time we were here. It's like until midnight, it feels like there's people wandering around doing something. Um, and the shops here won't shut until like 10 or 11 at night. So you literally can just live your life Anytime. later here. All than, the shops open. Yeah. Yeah, um, but they don't open till like 11 a.m. So if you're oh, up early, right, 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 right. it's, it's all right, just later here. Everything's okay, later. Cats, There's lots of cats. The BGC cats are very famous. They're actually quite well looked after here in BGC. That people feed them. There's like a whole program to feed the cats. Yeah. Okay. Um, so they're quite nice cats here. Deliveroo. <laughs> so what do you think of the high street? It's amazing. It's amazing. <laughs> There's a lot going on. I like all the sculptures, the installations as well. Yeah, it's really buzzy. Yeah, so many people just hanging around. They don't look like trouble. <laughs> <laughs> this is good for snacks if you ever get hungry snacks. as well. Yeah. A little healthy like snacks. A snack. yeah. So when we wake up at three o'clock in the morning. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Pop down for snacks. Yeah. Unless Julie's a youthful. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> So we've ordered the food. The two people that said they ate too much on the plane have also ordered a big old brisket burrito. Um, so we've got four beef burritos on the way. Hopefully they won't be long, but while we're waiting for it to cook, we're just walking up and down. Um, looks like something's been put up since earlier. But yeah, super busy still. Look at these tourists with their cameras uh, out. Okay. <laughs> Yes. There you go. Good face for it. You can be picky and critical, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> the monkey, do not overlook details and lose sight of the big picture, okay? <laughs> Five. because it's 11 o'clock at night and I don't want to disturb any other guests but I just had a quick drink up at the rooftop with my dad and Claire. Um, Code is asleep, George is editing in the room. I'm gonna head to bed now, have a quick shower and we've got a full day exploring BGC tomorrow but they were just saying how much they love BGC and how amazing it is and how great it is to be here and it's just been a really lovely evening so it's super surreal but they're here. The trip's fully started now and um, I can't wait to document it all in these videos so please make sure you're subscribed if you're not already and give the video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and we'll see you very soon in the next juicy vlog with our full tour guide mode bgc tour guides i feel like we're pretty good tour guides to bgc i think we know it quite well by now so um hopefully they have a really cool day tomorrow and um yeah we'll see you guys then so thanks for watching and good night